very well. Always fun to see in these kind of matchups, Kevin, if a coaching staff on either side decides to throw a wrench in the works and play a player or a combination of players that the other team is not expecting. Like you said, they know each other very well, but who will execute tonight? They'll get the win. Now here's Curry. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. The defense ready for him on that possession. They had to be because he is so strong in the paint. Here's Westbrook and finished off by Westbrook. That might be a 50 or we go in 100 or, or 1,000. Westbrook with a unique combination of power and athleticism. Now here's Curry and that one off the back of the rim and in. Now what a great option he gives them on every possession. LeBron passes to Howard. To the middle. Here's Westbrook. And Thompson sends it back. Clay showing some signs that time. He got the prime time defense he can bring. And now just over a minute played here in the first. Here's Curry. Pass to Wiseman. Golden State moving the ball around. Passes it to Green. Six on the shot clock. Curry outside. And no good that time. So the Lakers will take it the other way. Well, gravity is very, very real. And Steph Curry has the most of any NBA player right now. Brent, when you talk about the gravity of Curry, explain what you mean. Well, Kevin, any time that he's on the floor, when he crosses half court, all five defenders are paying attention to where Steph is. The more he moves, the more he shifts around the incredible attention of all five defenders. And when guys make one misstep, or you have two defenders make one misstep to carry their way to where Steph Curry is, it opens up easier opportunities on any possession. That's what we're talking about when we speak on Steph's gravity. That's good from Westbrook. Russell Westbrook just out there and focused, trying to find ways in which he can help out his team to secure any win. Both shots good from the strike. One of the big surprises with the NBA draft the trade of Russell Westbrook. Westbrook let it be known he was open to another move. And it'll be interesting to see how he fits next to LeBron and AD this season. Now here's Thompson. No one near Curry as he lets it go. That's in coming off the assist from Thompson. You can tell Curry's team just counting on him to finish the job on that play. Just trusting he'll put the dagger in. Here's James. The shot, no good. Great D that time from Green. Golden State's gone one or two from long range in the first quarter. Curry against Westbrook. Curry looking around. Here's Wiseman. Lays it up and in off the pretty assist. And Wiseman showing off his power that time. Lakers have gone two for four from the field so far today. LeBron against Green. James. That's in. And he found his range with that one. Now one for two. Uncovered at the rim. Finding cracks in the defense here early on. Just really smart basketball and exploiting whatever holes that he's seeing right now in the defensive squad. And they don't want to get in a habit of giving him open looks from three. First quarter still, but not who you want to leave open. Now here's James. And they double up James. And wrestling for it there, but no one has possession. He'll have a jump ball. How about that strong defensive performance for this half's mobile one block? And an early swat like that can really set the tone. Now the shooters will be feeling his presence. And here is Los Angeles now. Davis finds James, and they double up LeBron. Back to Davis, and it's Davis with the jam. You love 
how LeBron is able to lift the whole team with his passing. That facilitating gives them a lot of energy. Curry, good. Boy, he is looking confident. Love how they're using him so far. Yeah, right now I don't see any let up. I think he's going to just keep putting his foot on that gas pedal tonight. Now here's James. It's stolen by Curry. And here we go with Curry running it up the court. And there are the Warriors now with another bucket. Oh man, this would be a different ball game if they didn't have this type of scoring to rely on. James outside. And it's Davis finishing it off. That's a perfect lob leading to a spectacular dunk for Davis there. Threw it up on time, on target. Westbrook against Curry to the inside. Great D that time from Davis. Lakers trail by three. The drive by James. James on the attack, and that is absolutely terrifying. The Warriors have gone six of nine, shooting it well. Here's Curry. Score the bucket. He's made five so far, shooting a very clean five of seven. That kind of looks like a predictable shot, one that they want. The defense has to prevent the ball from getting into that sweet spot. So the Lakers call timeout their first. And as things present themselves throughout a game, teams have to adapt on the fly. And timeouts are a wonderful opportunity to just settle in and recollect the thoughts of your entire team. Not just the guys playing, but the entire team. change here for the Lakers. Then for the Warriors, Kevon Looney is checked in for Wiseman. Bial Itza comes in for Green, and it's Iguodala in for Andrew Wiggins. Here's Anthony. It's deflected. Another shot. Jordan kicks to Anthony. Pass to Nunn. Clock at four. Two minutes From outside, off the mark. And so it's Iguodala. He'll bring it up for the Warriors. It's a three-point game. And the Warriors get it back. It is good. Looney in the right Ooh. spot there. Good presence on the inside as he boxes the defense out and sends the ball right up. Now, here's none. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Shot from free throw range. They get it again. Short. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. And the sheer size of Jordan is just so tough for defenders sometimes to deal with. Skilled at picking up the foul there. Los Angeles shooting their third and fourth free throw shots of the night. Yeah, last year, collectively, only 74% from the line. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. He's off on the first. Well, the adventure begins when DeAndre gets to the line, but I, I think he's wanting to work hard on his free throws, so it's not a substitution in the last two minutes of a game. He wants to get confident stepping up and knocking them down. Yeah. 
so he can't get either to fall. And Bielitz is a terrific shooter, a big man, Brent, with real range, capable of really stretching the floor. Yeah, and I hate to just talk about Bielitsa as a pure shooter, and it's the only thing he does. There have been moments where he can make a play with the ball and, and make some good reads, but it is the shooting strength and the ability to draw out bigger players that really provide the juice from Bielitsa. They need a bucket in a big way here to regain some confidence. Back to none. Down low, here's Anthony. No good, unable to end this run. Well, you, you have to like their work on the boards, Kevin, particularly here to start the game. Thompson from long range. The Lakers with the rebound. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. Now, here's none. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. To the paint. Here's Anthony, and he banks in the lane. There's no stopping Melo there. Too strong for any kind of defense. It's going to take a bit more than that. Curry way outside. Oh, he got it to go. Patient. Bam. Wow, what a way to finish up the quarter. That's an incredible shot there. Just let it fly, take a chance, and somehow that one goes in. It's been all about Stephen Curry for the Golden State Warriors. And it was from three-point range where he did the most damage. He knocked down three in that quarter. We've got more in store for you right after this. We've heard Russell Westbrook say his job is to do everything, but he understands that it's also a team effort. We got to do it together. And I think that's more important than scoring any points or doing anything else is, is leadership. And uh, that's where I got to find my, my niche and uh, try to lead the guys. A great leadership, an area where Westbrook, I think, feels he's growing. And with his motor, he's always been a culture setter. But bringing your teammates along is also about setting the tone for collaboration. And glad to have you with us, folks. Second quarter of basketball. This game has not exactly been neck and neck, but plenty of time left in this one. What do you guys think about the Warriors here so far? Just stretching out the floor in that first, uh, they had the defense scrambling. Pretty prime example here of how to space the floor and do it correctly. When you do it, that's the kind of thing that happens. So with Thompson sitting on the bench, here's the group that Steve Kerr has on the floor. Looney out there with Bialis. Then there's Moody. Then there's Stephen Kerr. And it's Igor Allen at the three spots. And every year we see, Greg, some incredible comebacks. What distinguishes, in your mind, those with the resilience to battle back? I think it starts with a belief and desire. And the great ones truly hate to lose. Now here's Bazemore after the miss from Stephen Kirk. None passes to Rondo. Curry was a nice D. That's not going to make you a favorite target of your teammates. They'll think twice about feeding you if you're going to keep missing layups. Rondo with the steal. A minute and a half gone here in the second quarter. And there's the pass to Carmelo. Just five to shoot. Here's Bazemore. Rebound by Bialica. Warriors leading by nine. Pass to Moody. Over Anthony. Carmelo Anthony comes up with the rebound. And so it's Anthony bringing it up for the Lakers. Only given up two points this quarter. Here's none. And he makes no mistake on the slam dunk. And credit the screen for giving him the space he needed to get to the rim. For sure, G.A. allows him to come in with the sledgehammer. Yeah, why well, settle for the layup when you can attack the rim and rise up like that? And the Warriors decide to take their first time out here.
and your Laker girl. All right, look who's coming under the court. Get loud, here they are, your Laker girl. So they group substitution here for the Lakers. Dwight Howard's checked in for DeAndre Jordan. Anthony Davis comes in for Anthony. LeBron's checked in for Kent Bazemore. And it's Russell Westbrook in for Kendrick Nunn. Golden State also making some changes. Heisman's checked in for Looney. Green comes in for Bielitsa. And Wiggins is subbed in for Andre Iguodala. And it's sent back by Howard. Well, Dwight Howard Holy still makes baseball. you think about your shot attempts. Easily leaping up to throw that one away. The Lakers making a switch here. Monk's checked in. And the Warriors also making a change. Kuminga's come in for Moody. Quarter two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. And it's Wiggins missing. Lakers trail by seven. Westbrook passes to Howard. And that comes off the assist by Russell Westbrook. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. And now in the second half of his career, Russell Westbrook wants rings. He knows he's getting older and has no time to waste. It's why he plays with such passion. Now here's Wiggins. He's been pitching so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. And Westbrook's high motor is a new he love him. He goes out breaking and competes every play in every game. No doubt, but I tell you what, he's tired of missing out on the NBA Finals. This is a guy that is hungry to get back to that stage. It'll be interesting to see if he can get it done. First one falls for him. Andrew Wiggins, one of those guys who just doesn't miss a lot of games and is always able to bounce back from any off night offensively. And both free throws good for Wiggins. Now about three minutes gone in this second quarter of basketball. Inside. They get it back. Westbrook. Here's Howard. And finally they hit one. Yeah, not easy trying to keep Howard off the offensive boards. He excels at using his muscles and his size to get great position. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Here's Curry. Westbrook pulls it in. Westbrook's got his fourth rebound in this one. More good work on the glass there. When it's all said and done, I think rebounding might tell the story in this game. And now you see them starting to really work the ball inside. Here's Wiggins following the basket by Anthony Davis. Pass to Curry. Takes the three. And Trayvon Green picks up the foul. That is his first foul of the game. Clay Johnson is checked in for the Warriors. Personal foul. Substitution for the Warriors, Clay Thompson. And here's James. He'll bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. Their defense has only allowed four points in the quarter. Howard with it. To the inside. Monk dishes to Davis. Goes up to the strike. The kick out to Westbrook. Back to Howard. And he uses the glass on the way. Howard's got six here in this quarter. They're getting on a roll inside. Their last three field goals have come from the paint. 
And a wide open look here for Wiggins. He hits and the back the iron Warriors. and sinks the shot. And the Warriors lead by three. Outside Westbrook. He dishes it to Howard. Davis kicks to LeBron. Back to Westbrook. Six to shoot. Pass to Howard. The Lakers need to get a shot off him. And it's Davis missing. And he missed that one, but I've seen him drill shots from that distance in warm-up. Oh, no, I know he can make it, but th that's warm-up. So maybe just a step too far. Now here's Kaminga. No points in the game yet for him. And it's Wiggins missing. Oh, even though he misses that one, the defense has got to talk about that. And that's a bad miscue. And you can't give up looks like that all game long. Oh, nice silky yes, finish on the alley -oop from the yes, stupendous feed. That sequence couldn't have been executed any better. Thompson against Westbrook. Back to Thompson. To the middle. Here's Weisman. That's in. Coming off the assist from Thompson. Weisman's got his second bucket of the night. That's just a good look from Clay as his teammate was open. There's 57 seconds left to play here in the second quarter. It's stolen by Kaminga. Down low, here's Thompson, and a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Clay Thompson is tall for a guard, so if you want to utilize any advantage you have, that time height came into play. Well, something great we can't take for granted. It's nice just to see Clay Thompson out on the floor. No doubt, Kevin. You know, the NBA is just a better league with a healthy Clay Thompson. Makes this team more fun to watch. Good for humor and one incredible performance a year. The first free throw is good. And Brent, you look at the career of Clay Thompson, he's had improvements every step of the way. Yeah, and he's still just an elite shooter that because of what Steph does, because of Draymond's unselfishness, you know, Clay is going to add 25 points in the blink of an eye. Uh, that, along with his defense, just make that backcourt something special. And so Thompson nails both of them. And they're really getting more points at the free throw line here in the second quarter. The pass to Baseball. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. Howard finds none. That's it. He's got two made now. And he's shooting two for three. They are just killing him on the interior. Seven second difference. Shot in game clock. Pass to Wiggins. Back to Thompson. Shoots from 14. None grabs the board. And he rushed that one, no doubt about it. The D out of position, you could see the frustration on his face. Moves back up. And Jordan with the lead. DeAndre Jordan dominates this game on both ends around the glass. And that'll do it for the first half. A competitive game so far. Warriors lead by one. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks very much with the Lakers, Frank Vogel. Coach, with your size advantage, were you trying to get the ball to Anthony Davis inside? Uh, not any more than usual. We just give him the basketball down low and ask him to read. You know, there's been a couple opportunities where they came and doubled, and he found open guys. And if he gets single coverage, he goes for the ball. Thanks for your time, Coach. Appreciate it. Back to you guys. Thank you, David, and we'll be right back after halftime to start the third quarter. See you in just a bit. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello, basketball fans. What a pleasure it is to bring you into the 2K studios again. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jet Smith. The first half was all about Stephen Curry. He ended up with 17 points, two assists, and one steal. 
And last game, he could never really get going. Maybe that bit of fire under him tonight. Taking a look at the Warriors, Kenny, what'd you think? Well, the three-point shooting was the key thus far. When you're knocking down those shots from the perimeter, it really spreads the floor. You demand respect from the defense. We'll see if they can keep it flowing in the second half. And Shaq, what'd you think about the Lakers? Well, those second chance points are huge, and they only came because of the effort. Their work on the offensive glass is what's keeping them in the game. They definitely should try to continue to stay tough on the glass. It's been key so far. And that'll about do it as we get ready for the second half. Let's take you down to Kevin Harlan. Shout out to my main man, Joel. Joel, what up? And we've got second half action for you. Thus far, a pretty evenly contested game. Really an incredible game from Stephen Curry. Yeah, and through the first two quarters, he has been the offense for this team. Yeah, he's, he's shouldering the load right now and looking really comfortable while he's doing it. And the Lakers with possession here. They trail by one. Third quarter action getting rolling right now. Brought to you by Gatorade. All fueled up and ready to go. Here's who's on the floor. Taking a look at Los Angeles. And they have their big three all out there. Westbrook at the point with LeBron and Davis at the forward. Howard is out there with Monk. Here's Curry following the basket by Russell Westbrook. And Curry, here we go. The bucket is good. He'll have a chance for one more. That's it. Dwight Howard. Good focus there from Steph Curry muscling past the defense. Yeah, I said it muscled to get the contact. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. What's up? Free throw good by Curry. Yeah, no debate about the Currys and them being the best shooting family in NBA history. You know, Stefan and Seth have had remarkable careers along with their father, Del. In fact, going into the 2021-22 season, Seth actually had a better career three-point shooting average. How about them numbers? And boy, did he ever sell the pump fake. Worked to absolute perfection. Curry passes to Wiseman. A rebound by the Lakers. Davis has got four rebounds in this game. Shoots from 14. Can't hit that one. And Golden State will come the other way. Thompson passes to Curry. Westbrook with the steal. Monk with the ball. And Curry picks him up defensively. Howard and Howard with the stellar. No answer for Dwight Howard. That deep inside the paint. Always looking to throw it down. First minute and a half of basketball here in the third quarter. Thompson outside. Over Monk. And it's Thompson that time on the assist by Curry. Thompson's got the game tied up here for the Warriors. LeBron against Wiggins. Not loose. And here we go with Thompson running it up the court. Curry outside. And it's good. That bucket takes him to 9 for 14. That's 3 of 4 here to start the half. And here's James up bringing up for the Lakers. Takes it from 10. The Lakers keeping it going. A new 14-second shot clock. I'm not going to see that very often. The defense in the vicinity, but still, he's not one to blow layups. And out of bounds as the Lakers gain possession. His shot was hindered by that momentous mobile one block. And this is why coaches stress the importance of defense. Big block there in this close game. Some changes for the Lakers. Carmelo Anthony comes in for Dwight Howard. Rajon Rondo subbed in for Malik Monk. Moody's checked in for Golden State. Lakers trail by three. Well, Draymond Green holding everybody accountable. We've seen this before. Thompson against LeBron. 
That shot, no good. Good D by Thompson. There's the lob to the hoop, and the Warriors can't hang on to the ball. And so often, Tremont Green is called the heart of this team. Well, he's been such a great leader since his time at Michigan State. He's out there barking directions to his offensive players. He's out there barking defensive assignments. He's barking at his coach. It just the list goes on, but that energy is infectious and helps lead his team to greater heights. Now here's Davis after LeBron James's miss, and they double up Davis, just four to shoot. That one's in there. The Warrior lead is cut down to one on the bucket from LeBron. And when Anthony Davis sees that one of his guys is open because of the pressure the defense puts on him, he'll make the play. Thompson in the corner. Good, and Curry gets the assist. Curry's got four assists in the game. They've given up a lot of three-pointers here today. James looking it over from 12 feet out. Warriors with the rebound. Maybe a time to rest him right now. Just give him a bit of a breather. Try to help him get back on track. Thompson dishes to Curry. And another three for Golden State. And guys, he's been a one-man air raid coming at them time and time again. Kind of like he's in his living room right now. He's found a comfort zone. Once he gets that, the defense knows they're in trouble. Now here's LeBron. He's got six. Steps back and shoots. Westbrook, no good. Here's Moody. And the slam by Moody. Well, Clay Thompson can shoot the ball and score. We know that. He's also a capable defender. We know that. But how about checking out his playmaking? Los Angeles calls timeout. And if you need help spacing the floor, Moody's your guy. He's a nightmare to defend. An elite three-point shooter, you have to go out and guard him. But if you close out too hard, he can put the ball on the floor and take advantage of the driving lane. So pick your poison. Some changes here for the Lakers. Jordan, he's checked in for Davis. Riza comes in for LeBron. And it's Kendrick Nunn in for Russell Westbrook. Then for the Warriors, Looney's checked in for Wiseman. Hialitza comes in for Green. And it's Iguodala in for Moody. Here's Anthony. And no good. The dry spell continuing for him. inside. Curry. He's covered by Rondo. This and there's Stephen good. Curry on the assist by Thompson. Thompson. And what a half for this offense. If they can stay this high, a great chance to extend this lead. None with it. Rooney on him. None can't get it to fall. All the energy is on the other side right now, and every miss just makes it worse. Well, the other team is scorching hot, and they come down on this end and can't find a way to get the embers going. So it's the Lakers now. The Warriors making the shot. Anthony kicks to none. Passes to Rondo. To the paint. Whoops, they pick off the pass. Here's Igudala. Good tee by Ariza. And it's Ariza with the ball for the Lakers. It's a 13-point game. Rebound by Bialica. Warriors have gone 8 of 10 shooting here in the second half. Very strong. Iguodala, the pass to Thompson. Over Rondo. That one a little long. Well, mid range is where he makes the money. So when the D's slow to get out on him, always surprising to see him miss from there. Now here's Rondo. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Out to Anthony. Ariza outside. 
over Thompson. And again, no good by the Lakers. Well, that's a shot they want just about on every possession, if they can get it. He doesn't make them all, but still very much a high percentage look. And that's out of bounds. Golden State will retain Golden possession. Ball. Kent Bazemore is checked in for Rajon Rondo. The Warriors also with a sub. Wiggins is checked in. There's 45 seconds left in the third. And, and that one is good. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really Start impressed timeout. with their oh, offensive the execution. Los Angeles calls timeout. And how about getting the band back together? Right. I mean, Iguodala in a Warriors Good uniform, considered retirement, right. and couldn't resist one more run with the team he's won three titles with. Who's coming under the court? Get loud. Here they are. Your Laker girl. And your Laker girl. He's checked in for the Lakers. Lakers trail by 15. And Bazemore kicks to Monk. Back to Bazemore. Pass to none. Lakers working the ball around now. Here's Anthony to end the run. A nice shot by Jordan. Oh, allowing the defense oh. to cover him or alter his shot there was DeAndre Jordan getting to the rim. Outside Curry. DeAndre Jordan grabs the miss. Jordan's got rebound number seven for him tonight. Count it. Good. Hello. Anthony's got six points. Uh, catching the lead pass at full speed. Terrific anticipation. And the delivery on time on target. Here's Curry with the three. I'm gonna go that time. And so it's the Golden State Warriors holding on to an 11-point cushion as we get ready to take a break. Their defensive mindset clearly focused on clapping down on LeBron James and their game plan is working. We'll get right back to the action when we return. And let's take now this moment to bring up our State Farm assist of the game. And the definition of teamwork right there, guys. I mean, what great communication between them, and what a beautiful feat. The coaches talk about it all the time, but to be able to play with that kind of feel, nice play collaborating, improvising, and organic. And one quarter to go in a game that, to this point, has not been an evenly fought contest. So with Thompson sitting on the bench, here's the group that Steve Kerr has on the floor. We've got Iguodala. Higgins is out there with Stephen Curry. Then it's Nemanja Bialica. And it's Looney in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. And here's Nunn. After the three-pointer from Stephen Curry, Nunn finds Monk. Jordan trying to free himself up. There's the pass to Monk. Shot clock at five. Here's Bazemore. And they had their chances. Two offensive rebounds. But they still come up empty. Inside. The Elitza with the bucket. And the Warriors lead by 16. How many times have we seen a possession like that from them today? Ending with a basket coming off a pretty pass. To the inside. Here's Jordan. 
Lee Baz was put in just the right spot. Look how focused DeAndre Jordan is on those finishes through the contact. Wiggins passes to Looney. On the wing, Iguodala, guarded by Jordan. Curry's shot is off. And so it's none with it. He brings it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. They trail by 14. On the wing, Monk. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. Warriors have gone two of three from the field to get the fourth quarter start. Curry against Bazemore. Looney. That one misses. So Los Angeles will take it the other way. Here's none. Finished off the break. Kendrick, but Ken no. Bazemore knows that his contributions come from being active and Bazemore becoming a better time passer. Out, time Timeout call. called the Warriors. Big group substitution here for the Lakers. White Howard's checked in for Jordan. Davis comes in for Carmelo Anthony. LeBron, he's checked in for Kent Bazemore. And Russell Westbrook is subbed in for Kendrick Nunn. Then for the Warriors, Heisman. Oh! And how about the acrobatics from Andrew Wiggins? Way up that time. And now, let's revisit that exceptional mobile one block. Sharp instincts on D there. Just timing. When to rise up and swat that one away. Back to LeBron. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. That's on James Wiseman. And getting to the line at will, James using... His smarts the these line, days to draw those kind of shooting fouls. LeBron Let's quickly James. check out the scoring breakdown here at for the, the Warriors. They keep piling up the assists, and they haven't cooled off at all. And it's a feel-good night from behind the three-point line, racking up a ton of threes. Free throw drops for James. LeBron James coming into the league as a phenom has done some phenomenal things season after season remaining a top talent in the league and continues to astound. He hits both from the strike. We're in the fourth quarter here just under two and a half minutes gone. Curry against Westbrook. Curry passes to Moody. Pass to Wiseman. Green breaking loose. Offensive rebound. They've been the better rebounding team by a healthy margin, but it hasn't been enough. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Just shake your head at the size of LeBron James. And once he gets into the paint and gets pinballed around, Gets that contact and finds free throws. For the Lakers, LeBron James. Two shots. Two, two. And the first one at the line is good. Clay Thompson, he's checked in for Moody. Yeah. 
And both free throws good for LeBron. This is as good as it gets from the charity strike here in the second. Thompson outside to the middle. Here's Wiseman. That's in. Dang Coming off Wiseman. the assist from Thompson. Assisted. Thompson's got Play assist number Thompson. eight now on the night. Lakers trail by 12. Outside Westbrook. Wiggins against LeBron. Addition now to Davis. And he finishes nicely and on the way. Superb pick and roll action capped off with a perfect pass to the slashing AD. Leads to the easy deuce. Warriors leading by 10. Over three and a half minutes through the final quarter now. Thompson surveying the floor. Shot clock at six. And Davis sends it back. Well, the offense not getting anything easy while Anthony Davis is on the floor. Passes it to Monk. And then Monk with the dunk. The adjustments they've made offensively, they're putting guys in a position now to succeed. The possession's just way more efficient, I think, here tonight. Taking smarter, better shots, moving the ball around. That's helped them to get back in the ball game. Thompson the bounce pass. Davis against Green. Let's it go from deep. That one's not going to go. Davis with some nice deep. On the wing, Davis. Nice passing here by Los Angeles. Westbrook finds Howard. Back to Westbrook. There's the triple. Warriors with the rebound. Well, the D doesn't seem to be too worried about him from three-point range, and he shows us why still. I expect him to make one of those. Uh, unwilling to let up even for a moment. That's his killer instinct just fanning through the flame. And he's the guy that you want to go to right now trying to put this one away. And too much time in the lane. They get called for the three-second violation. Warriors leading by 10. And there's a minute 45 left in the fourth quarter. Curry is inside. He's covered by Westbrook. And Davis sends it back. Last break. The Lakers bobbed up there for Howard. And the Lakers with another turnover here. Looked like a simple play and turned into a turnover. Can't give away possessions like that. And here are the Warriors now. And here is Curry over Westbrook. And good. And it takes a nice bounce off the right iron and down. Curry's got 16 here in the second half. Westbrook passes to Howard. Green with the block. I oh, like the extension there from Draymond Green reaching out and timing that one. And these are the types of games where one team clearly has the edge. Tonight, it will be a win by a large margin for the Warriors. You know, it's Dang tough to put your finger right. on the deciding factor in this one, but I'd say that the shooting accuracy made the difference. Yeah, I think you're on point, Kevin. They got better looks, and that tends to lead to a better field goal percentage. The one player that really stands out, of course, in this one, it was a dazzling game for Stephen Curry. It looked like a couple times they might be wearing him down, but not the case. At the offensive end, he was just devastating. Thompson outside. Makes it off the glass. Please. Making every effort to put this game on ice. You love that the guys are staying aggressive late in this ball game, just not wanting to let go of the rope. Just two seconds between shot clock and game clock. James finds Davis to stop the run. And it's Curry with the rebound. So we see the Warriors taking the game here. 
This one was over well before the final buzzer. The fans were waiting for something to get excited about, Greg, but they never got it. They sure didn't. I mean, they just rolled to this win. They made it look really easy. What an efficient performance at both ends. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks very much. Draymond, one of the cliches of basketball is that the ball finds energy. When teammates are making shots, does that give you more energy? Oh, uh, yeah, it does. You know, when we're in the flow, the ball is just moving around. It allows me to play make, and you know, then I just try to find an open gap and take the shots where they are. Man, it was really flowing tonight, man. Congrats on the win. Back to you. Thank you, David. Great interview once again. And that'll do it, folks. For Greg Anthony, Brett Berry, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA, presented by 2K Sports. And we'll see you next time.